the sector is under a lot of pressure, uh, financial performance pressure, climate pressures, all sorts of other social pressures, right? So what we have to do is to make sure that we are addressing the customer challenges and better we get at addressing customer challenge, faster we can move them towards delivering their KPOs, the higher the chance that they will be, we will be differentiated. So when I think about that digital transformation or that digital journey we are on, we call this whole journey alpha. So alpha is not a widget. It's not one piece of machinery we buy from a third party and plant it on our rig. It's that whole way of thinking about delivering customer KPIs in a much more efficient way. When you hear about weight to weight, that's a smaller piece of that automation journey, but it was the, the simplest and the easiest to execute, easiest to show value to start with, okay? And then you really you know, transform from going from sequence automation, which I always refer to as um, you know, that cruise control on your car. It's simple two, three things, watch the speed limit, give me the speed, don't bump into the next car, keep in the lanes, you know, kind of simple steps. And really the journey is going to be all about how do we go from there to that autonomous drilling? How do we take complex processes? How do we optimize bit interaction with a rock? How do we make sure some of the drilling risks like um, drill string vibration, stuck pipe, eventually kicks, gas detections, etc. How do you make sure that what we have learned with the best of our drillers, with best of our ROP, SOPs, working with some of the clients who really have the size standards, how do we combine all of that and then deliver it every single time? Going from sequences into complex algorithms and machine learning and AI into really getting the driller to be looking at the right data to making optimized decisions is that whole alpha journey.